morning, y'all. Definitely an early morning for us this morning. Um, the next stage and the next thing we're, things we're doing to Project Family Hauler, as you guys can tell, we're in the truck. Um, we're going to get a topper installed. We're going to go ahead and fix the bed rug and put some lights back there so that way we can start actually taking family road trips and keeping things dry and secure. That being said, technically we already fixed the bed rug. I had some father-son time with my oldest yesterday and I didn't feel like recording. So we're heading over to Autoplex here in Colorado Springs to pick up our ARE bed cover. Um, once we get there, we'll show you guys the truck without and with, and then go over what we're doing with the bed. So let's get this going and we'll, we'll be there shortly. You guys can see the bed has shrunk a little, the bed rug, but we went ahead and re-velcroed it up. That way it's nice and tight, so when we get the cover on here, it'll fit right. We've got some stains and some crap in here, but I do haul crap with this, so I'm not worried about it. guys we're just stepping outside we got word that our topper is done so let's go ahead and see what this thing looks like on here but open it Bubba If you guys can't hear them over the traffic, this is what the inside looks like. Went ahead and did some dog protectors on the glass on both sides. Did a sliding at the front. And you could put anything on the back here. Yep, and we're going to be doing some bed lights in here. I don't know what we're doing this video, but I, I really want to thank Autoplex. These guys are outstanding. They did a good job installing it. So, 
Now the difference between the Lear and this one, to me, was the fact that the Lear has a frameless rear window, but I'm not too worried about that. Um, it wasn't worth the price difference. It was a couple hundred dollar difference between the Lear and the ARE. So, They installed it. They installed it. ARE is the one who made it, Bubba. Ah. Got the topper behind me. We're starting to do some a few other additions to it. Um, I told you we're starting to get the bed ready for family hauling and stuff. That being said, you can see I got a string hanging. It's just some 550 cord. The missus told me it was a little bit too tall for her to reach, so we made a little pull cord for her. Then we're going to put some weather strip on the tailgate and try to seal that off from the elements. The carpet kit seals the bottom of the tailgate, so we're going to just try to seal the edges. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So we're going to mock up a piece just on the inside here. And I apologize for the noise. Like I said, I got, they got guys doing work on our screen. So, something like that. We're going to take it, kind of marked, we're just going to cut it with a pair of dikes. Now, I'm sorry for all the background noise, y'all, but this is what happens. Guys closer. Just a thin section. And that's just seal up against the tailgate. Well I have a moment of quiet from the guys using a ditch witch out there. So what I did is I took a small section here, came down, and a small section here where the carpet rug doesn't cover it. And then I did the same on this side over here. And I put a small section on the tailgate right here, so it should close and seal on there. Now the topper already has something here. Oops, sorry guys. So that should all work in cohesion together. Well, we're going to end our video here. I thought this stuff was going to work. It's too thin. So I'm going to need to figure out a new game plan. Uh, look for a video coming up where I can... Find something a little bit thicker to use in here and we'll also address not having any lights in the cargo area so well that's a strikeout with all the noise going on on a positive note my pull cord works lovely just some 550 cord yeah quick fix so end this on a positive the topper is really nice quality Got to add some bed lights, got to figure out what I'm going to do about this tailgate seal, and we'll go from there. Alright you guys, we're going to go ahead and end this video here. I just wanted to say, um, unfortunately the tailgate seal idea didn't work. We'll readdress that situation in the next video when we install some bed lights. Big thank you to Autoplex for helping us pick out our topper, um, ARE versus Lear. Lear was a little more expensive, ARE was more cost effective for us. So uh, that's why we went with them. Uh, thanks for watching, y'all. God bless. Y'all have a good one.